Okay, this tutorial is to show how to use the ground control point interface in Web ODM. It took me a little bit to figure out the workflow, and so I figured I'd share it. So when you you have your dashboard and you have um, different projects you've been working on, but you want to create a ground control point file um, that links photos in the field to GPS positions you've recorded. So the first thing is to um, fly your drone survey, take point, take pictures, and then also go to known ground control points in the survey and take GPS readings. Um, and once you're in WebODM, you can load a text file of the uh, ground control points. This, So I just have an example one here. I hit open and it imports the control points, shows you what the layout is, and there's information online about the, the required format here, but this is essentially the coordinate system. This is the name of the ground control point. This is the uh, coordinates of that ground control point. So then you hit load and in the right it loads the, the position of those ground control points in space according to where your GPS is. All right, so now we need to add some images. So we'll just click Choose Images here. And I just have a, some random pictures. I'll just select all those, throw them in there. And now we need to link ground control points to our images. So assuming I would... Um, have some points in here. You can see as I hover over, both of those points are uh, highlighting. So I can move this one to some known spot, and then I can click on this side to confirm it. When you add another one, click the map while well, that's highlighted. Then you click where that one is and see how it turns green. Now those are both associated. Um, here, oh yeah, you click that, so that one's highlighted, and say it references, we know it's GCP1, so we click that, and that's green. Add another control point there, and maybe that represents uh, this control point, GCP4. Okay, so we have three in that picture, and it says it up here, there's three there. Let's go to this picture, double click, 